Batman Van 3 just got its second teaser trailer, so we're gonna react to that. But since it's also like a 40 seconds long, we're also gonna react to something else from Pogo's Pizzeria on so we have FNAF movie release date, which the other day ago was confirmed that we don't know the release date, but it might have re but there might be a reveal on Freddy Fazbear's suit. Because of the thumbnail. So let's get into the reaction. First, we're going to react to Pogo's Pizzeria's video. Right here. Now, I saw this and then I went, oh, let's go to YouTube and check this out. What? It was one minute ago. <laughs> one view. <laughs> Still one view? No. Ah, on on. This might be a review on. Guys, Freddy Fazbear Two has been revealed. Watch Daco. Open the door to a new. Dude, we're gonna have to be blown up. A partnership is critical to ensuring patient health. We need to empower dental professionals and give them scientific information. Making sure that patients are cared for. Our passion is this work. It is exciting to really improve people's lives. What's going on, guys? Do come back again. Hope you're fantastic today. Wait, what, As you've seen from the in that image. Wait. Oh my gosh, is that Paper Rubio like Abby standing right next to Freddy? That is the title and the thumbnail. Crazy news. The FNAF movie is coming out this year in October. Thumbnail. Crazy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna text my dad because he's the one bringing me and Matthew in a sketch world. My freaking God! Come on, guys. I was just freaking out, guys, in excitement. <sighs> but me and Matthew are going to go on the 28th. This is amazing. The news the FNAF movie is coming out this year in October, the 27th of October. 2023 the FNAF movie is releasing it's only just finished filming and it's coming out this year not only that guys we got a third <laughs> Yes, 
guys, this is true. That is the Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. With Piper Rubio, Abby, standing right next to Freddy Fazbear. Freddy! It's Freddy Fazbear! They got the Freddy Rubio! And he also doesn't have the gloves on. But still! A sneak peek of what the movie's gonna look like. A first teaser reveal of the Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Place with Freddy Fazbear and Abby outside of the location. For the first pizza place with... Oh my god. Guys, this is insane. True insanity. This is just amazing. Yeah, this is real, guys. This is not just some sort of joke. This is real. Fazbear and Abby outside of the location. For the first teaser, guys, this looks absolutely incredible, man. So we've seen the Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Place sign. We've seen this location before when it was set up like this. We have not seen an official reveal of any animatronic yet. This is it, man. This is it. This is it. It's happening. An official first teaser. For the movie, I, I'm speechless, guys. It looks awesome, man. As you can see, it is the location with the pizzeria sign. We've seen this before. We've made videos about this before, too. This was in a public place, uh, and we spoke about it in multiple videos. I think this I think this is an actual photo, um, because I'm pretty sure we saw this animatronic before, right? Remember? We saw Freddy outside of the location in this in a very similar position. I think we did say that it's either going to be for the movie where we see Freddy outside the building or Freddy inside uh, uh, inside the doors. That was Golden Freddy though. That was not that that looked exactly like Golden Freddy, not normal Freddy. Just looking outside or for movie posters. Why is Freddy missing it's here? exactly that, guys. It's a teaser. We've got the reveal of Freddy Fazbear. Well, the back of Freddy Fazbear, which is still really cool. But the reveal of Abby as well. Abby is playing Mike Schmidt's younger sister in the movie. It looks like from here, she's getting taken to the abandoned location. Universal Pictures will release Blumhouse's Five Nights at Freddy's on Friday, October 20th. <laughs> I guess we don't need to go to theaters.
27th, 2023, worldwide. The film will also premiere day and date with theatrical release on Peacock. The terrifying horror game phenomenon becomes a blood-chilling cinematic event as Blumhouse, the producer of Megan, The Black Phone, The Invisible Man, brings Five Nights at Freddy's to the big screen. The film follows a troubled security guard as he begins working at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. While spending his first night on the job, he realizes the night shift at Freddy's won't be so easy to make it through. Starring Josh Hutcherson, Matthew Lillard, Elizabeth Lale, Connor Sterling, Piper Rubio, and Mary Stewart Masterson. Five Nights at Freddy's is directed by Emma Tammy and is written by Scott Cawthon, Emma Tammy, and Seth Kudaback. Kudaback? The film's iconic animatronic characters will be created by Jim Henson's Creature Shop. Five Nights at Freddy's is produced by Jason Blum and Scott Cawthon. The film's executive producers are Bia Sakira. Russell Binder and Christopher H. Warner. Universal Pictures presents a Blumhouse production in association with Striker Entertainment. Hashtag FNAF. So that's pretty much it, guys. There is. Of Meg. Yep, let's go. So PG thirteen, make the, the black phone, the invisible man, bring up to Studio Iconic produced by Russell in Associates. There is an official FNAF movie Twitter account. Go. to an official instagram account where the image was found um, so i'll put the link in the description to those they're going to update us with movie posters and the trailer etc because the movie's coming out later this year i'm expecting to see a trailer around summertime before then we'll probably see some more teasers but i think summertime would be a good time to release the trailer and some more movie posters etc but yeah that's pretty much it guys have a look at the image yourself analyze it uh, the the only thing i've noticed with freddy is that his ears missing which is interesting yeah Other than that, it's a solid iconic well, hold on Jocko, Jocko, Jocko. wait you want to go see it is his ear missing in the movie? Really yeah. excited with the location and Freddy and Abby uh, about to go into the pizza. This was taken a little while ago, though, guys. Meaning, this that was Golden Freddy we saw because in the image, Freddy looked very yellow. You know, I mean, I can put it on screen for you guys now. Um, as you can see, guys, he is very um very like yellow you know and the building was just taken down okay guys so because they did take the building down here's another image right right and right there there's another picture as you can see it's been taken down so basically this was taken when it was the building was up which was actually a little while ago because they did take it down like the building like three three weeks to a month ago i think like three weeks ago maybe a month but i think it was like three weeks ago but that means and that image of freddy was like a month ago like a little over a month ago and he was not um he's not that yellow in this image this was when it was this was looking when it was all up you know so that's what's kind of interesting. So I think it was Golden Freddy we saw. I hope it was, because Golden, Golden Freddy's going to... Come on, guys. Afton's going to die. We we know that Afton's going to die because of the spring trap mask, which I put on screen for you right there. Here's the thing. That's not spring trap. Because if you can see, spring trap has, like, human flesh. And 
This one has no flesh, no skull or anything. We know that after God is all the red human flesh brought because he was rotting for three years. His skin rots, you know? I mean, twist, um, the Twisted One's graphic novel even reveals because like three years after he died, he gets up and he still has the skin. It's not all that rotted flesh, you know? So, basically, I think Springtrap's not going to be in this. He's going to be in the FNAF 3 movie, which was confirmed by Matthew Love. There will be three movies. I'm recording a video. Okay, I'll get it done by then. More than just... I know. Sometimes. I'll get it done. I'll get, I'll get all of that. Okay. But anyway, guys, this is... I think we're just going to see him at Springlock, which Golden Freddy has to be there for that. You know? He has to. So basically, yeah, this is real. I don't know why Freddy doesn't have gloves, but... More accurate, but the sign's not. Um, Still, this is amazing. Surya. Really excited for this. I am very surprised about the release date as well. That's insane. Perfect time as well, just before Halloween. It's going to be such a great Halloween, man. I'm so excited. We are going to have a great year. Let me know your thoughts, guys, in the comment section, please. What do you think about this? It's super exciting. And of course, whenever there's new FNAF movie posters or more teasers, I'll make sure to make a video and we'll talk about it, okay? The most important thing is the release date. I can't believe it's coming out this year. It's going to be absolutely insane. I can't wait and the first teaser for the movie is amazing it, i think it's literally a picture i don't think they've edited much on it i, I really don't it, it's just amazing nice a nice simple fnaf teaser um which is what we've always loved since day one it's actually pretty emotional uh thinking about that actually it's just a great way great way to tease the movie uh, and i know everybody's going to be happy about this so yeah get ready guys seven years it's guys happening. Take care, lots of love, thanks for watching. 2015. I'll see you all next time. 2015. 2015. I think it's actually now been about nine years. Hello, that one FNAF guy here. And we are indeed talking about the highly anticipated FNAF. FNAF guy, hey man. How's it going, man? I forgot to give you your shout out, but hey man. How's it going? One FNAF guy, big shout out to him. I'll comment that right now. Um. Um, yeah, big shout out to him. I, I said I'd give him a shout out, but I never ended up doing it. This is insane. Oh, yeah, we also got the casting numbers for Freddy. So to help you remember that Liberty uh, Mutual customizes your home insurance, here's a uh, touching yeah. moment. Liberty Mutual? It's perfect. Only pay for what you need. Liberty, 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 but just yesterday, Liberty, Freddy Liberty. and Chicken's we said you got revealed, and now it's You won't take a time out. One dose of Ubrelvi quickly stops so monitoring and tracks within two hours. Do not take with strong cyst 2 4 inhibitors. Most common side effects were nausea and tiredness. Ask it's about Ubrelvi anytime, anywhere, I mean, it's migraine medicine. Today. What's up, guys, and welcome to a brand new Five Nights at Freddy's update video. Now, this is going to be a big one. We have a movie to see Stacy to pass as the voice. Motion, cap this. motion capture. Uh, see Stacy to be Fazbear. So that's exciting. I'm saying that right. Now, some of the other stuff that we have on here is uh, apparently Adam Han Beard, I hope I'm saying that right, has been cast as a voice and motion capture for Freddy Fazbear. So that's so the thing, along with Stacy DePass as the voice and motion, cap motion capture for Chica. So these are going to be the people playing the animatronics or, you know, doing the motion capture at least. <laughs> Those are the voice actors. Let's go. Anyway, Garn Bam Bam time. Do not. Okay, FNAF part's over. We're gonna start talking about that. But here's gonna be a man. Don't do it down there. Oh my gosh. Nab Nab Jumbo Joshin.
Opila. Slow Salina. Singer form. Hold on, let's try to brighten this up real quick. If we can. Let's go, let's see if we can brighten this up. Alright, so that's Jumbo Dress, that's Stinger Flynn, that's Opila, that's Slow Saline, that's Nam Nam Now. Seems we might have some new characters. So yeah, this is, this is cool. Let's check out their Steam page, by the way, just because no, okay, no, no updates. Okay. One of the games they got cancelled, apparently, a few of them. Well! Garten of Band Band! Hope you guys enjoyed this video, but first off, I'm just something for you guys. Real quick. Let's just, uh, try and see if we can do this. Okay, it's not gonna be a real a much of a challenge, but. Go on some forgotten memories. We're gonna do a lot of my style. Hey, Connor, don't don't yell at me. It's just a little thing, just to do something else in this video because you know I don't really talk. I just kind of reacted. I'm just gonna do this quickly. It's gonna be a custom edit. I'm gonna put on one character, actually two. Let's see it. Do it cheaper at that much though, but it's a little bit hard. So let's put her at seven. 
And then, let's just start. I'm Amber. Fudge. Fudge! Do have oxygen to worry about though. Errors. Just not having a puppet. One's about to go off.
something's about to happen. Okay. Okay, now, what do I want this? I'm just, this isn't even what we're doing for this video. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. We got this video so for now. So let's go. Um, See you guys in the next video. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.